What's up? This is the Phantom V on how to fix an export problem on Cubase when it's not exporting the whole file. Stay tuned. First off, let's start by exporting the audio mix down. Here we go. Main vocals. Export mono mix down. Vocals for a song. So I export it. try to do this as fast as we can but we gotta wait for Cubase are you with me there it is There it goes, I exported to this folder. And there it goes, see? I lined it up with the vocals, and it's only, it stopped right about there. You see? Right there. So. Open up the vocals to see what's going on. Because I've been having this problem with my engineer. You know, he let me have the session. I'm gonna split the file so I can know where I'm at. Cut. So I can know where I'm at. You can always replace that file. You can see it. it stop right there. And you wonder why, right? There. And there it is. And there it is. An undeleted piece of recorded session. And that was the whole problem. That little piece of undeleted session that was not deleted correctly. The engineer couldn't figure it out where I booked the studio to record the session. So he let me have the session. I had to bring it back to my own DAW and figure it out. I actually sometimes edit my own stuff. We're gonna export. Mono or vocals. You don't wanna export in stereo because they'll be left and right. Mono is just one single channel. So 
We gotta wait for the export. There it is. I exported it. And I place it, and you see, voila. Audio export complete with no problem. So I had to share it with you guys. Like, man, if you have a problem and you can do some kind of video to show us how to fix something that you have a problem with in your doll, please share, man. It's important. So we could all learn from each other. Thank you. The Phantom B, I'm out.